what ninety seventy dollars gonna do? How long is gonna last? You know, how long is that actually gonna last until you go rob somebody else and it's gonna keep on going on and on and on? This the man has got to stop. Community members and law enforcement growing frustrated with the recent crime happening across Beaumont. The city saw four homicides in the last two weeks of November, along with a handful of robberies. It may seem like things are getting worse, but the numbers tell a different story. 12 News reporter Jordan James live tonight with new insight from police. Yeah, Jordan, November marked one of the most deadliest months of the year for the city of Beaumont with four homicides, but officials say it's important to take a hard look at the numbers to have a better perspective about the city's crime rate. Talk to anyone across Beaumont, and they're sure to have an opinion about the crime. I'm going to move back to Beaumont, man. There's too much going on. It's getting bad. I, I, I say it's, it's, it's pretty bad. Like, you need to be on guard out here. It's a shame. We first introduced you to Jordan Sam a few weeks ago after his brother Ron Guillory was killed in a robbery at a Beaumont apartment complex. That tragedy changed his perspective. Because, I mean, I read about all the stuff happening on the news, you know. I read it and, you know, I keep going, but when it happened at your house, it's like, whoa, this is real, you know? The reality is Beaumont is on pace to surpass its total homicides from 2019. According to our records, there were 18 homicides last year. In 2020, there have been 17. But Beaumont police say still, there is no need to panic. We're, we don't live in a perfect world, mm -hmm. but at the same time, we can't go around saying that, uh, this is the worst it's ever been. Beaumont Police Assistant Chief Jim Clay provided 12 News with data which suggests that crime overall has gone down from the mid 80s till now. You hear too much of, well, this is the worst it's ever been. It's, right. so, it's so bad and we're like, no, it's not. And actually property crime has decreased quite a bit. And then even the violent crime is not near what it was you know, uh, 25 years ago. In terms of homicides, Beaumont logged nearly 40 back in 1994. The closest the city has gotten to that was in 2014 with just over 30 murders. Since 2008, property crimes like burglaries and theft have decreased, but violent crimes like murder and assaults have slightly increased over the last four years. Unfortunately, we can't stop every crime that occurs by being visible, Hopefully we can deter some crime from occurring. A sentiment felt by many across the community. It's just a bunch of sadness. This is too much. Y'all need to cut it out out here. On our website, you can take a closer look at these crime statistics released from Beaumont Police at 12newsnow.com. Reporting here live from Beaumont, Jordan James, 12 News.